Get excited, hurry. It's Vlogmas day one. Actually, this is supposed to be the part where I put the intro, but because it's day one and because you guys haven't seen the intro yet, I'm not going to be putting it in. I am basically going to be showing you guys behind the scenes of doing the intro. This is shot ahead of time. Everything from getting my nails done, my hair done, the whole shoot itself, decorating, the theme behind it. I'm not going to say too much because I want you all to see the process as the process goes on. It is Saturday the... I have no idea you know what the date is. I think 26. Oh, yes, Saturday the 26th and I'm about to leave. I'm about to go get my nails done by Nails at BW. I will put her price list, I'll put her contact in the description box. And I'm so excited because she, she does my nails all the time and they always look so bomb. And I have an appointment with her at 2 p.m. and right now it is 12.40. I am showered, I look cute, I am ready to go. And I still haven't chosen a nail design. I don't know what I'm going to do, guys. But I want pink nails, which is risky because I do natural hair and you guys come with your hair dyed. And you guys know how easy it is to like change the color of like, you know, nails and stuff. But you know what? Bad bitch or bad bitch, bitch will like. It's what it is. <laughs> yeah, I'm a bad bitch. You can't kill me. I'll just have to deal with it. I I just like the way they look. And personally, I'm not really a color person. I can't do butter nails or purple nails or all that. Then no, no, no. Plus, you will see why I said I'm doing pink nails when I get my hair done. But anyway, I'm wasting so much time talking to you guys. But I did miss you guys. And I am. This is the first video to vlog my. It's so exciting. 25 entire videos, you guys. 25. And but that's just by the end of Vlogmas, in the middle of monetized. When things go right, if things go right, we have to be monetized at the end of the 25 vlogs. Um, before I get into anything, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you doing, babe? Do you wanna miss Vlogmas, huh? What game are you playing? Make sure that you subscribe to my channel, make sure that you like this video, make sure that you turn on your notification bell, and most importantly, make sure that you watch this video to the very end. I'm going to be taking you guys through everything. There's going to be like 25 days of videos, not just vlogs, but other stuff as well. I'm very excited for you guys to see my intro shoot. I've been planning it for months, and like, it's going to be so cool. It's going to be so cool. I need to go, I need to do it. Let me go get my nails done. <laughs> my forehead is coming out to play i look good every single time my forehead is out i look scrumptious i just got my hair washed i did an update you guys yesterday on the nail situation as you can see my nails are still looking very terrible so yesterday I, when i was about to leave you remember like i started this vlog saying that you know i'm gonna get my nails done i'm so excited and everything guess what my mom calls me immediately after filming that video and says i'm on my way to come help you move the rest of your stuff so i couldn't go get my nails done i was so sad like literally i cried i cried because everything just felt so overwhelming we were still left with getting our hair done so i went and washed my hair it was very impromptu i was gonna wash my hair myself but then i passed by the salon right by my hood and i was like you know what 
might as well get it done plus i didn't have time to do it myself so i got my hair washed and blow dried and my scalp is out and i look so cute my skin is skinny there's just something about a tight hairstyle that just makes your skin look so good i'm supposed to go get my hair done go hair do with cook and i don't know she is not answering her phone right now we're supposed to, our appointment was supposed to be for nine but it's 12 right now it's 11 actually she told me to come at 12 because she was moving out of school and i don't have to go there if she hasn't actually moved so i've been trying to call her to see if she's home i'm hungry i haven't eaten but i bought something to eat so i don't know i'm just probably gonna just get on the combi and then i'll eat there or something like that which is not gonna be cute i don't like eating when other people are not eating it's just halfway thing has this so i don't want i don't have a choice at this point i'm just gonna have to leave because she's not answering her phone and i don't want to be late i don't know i don't know how far it is into the way if it's close into the way i won't be late but if it is i will be late so sorry girl in advance love you you know that love you loads anyway i know the braids are gonna look so cute i know they're gonna look so fire hey can't tell you now did i not want to scream when the lady was blow drying my hair here's the thing i already have my version of blow drying my hair if you watched my things to do and things not to do with natural hair video this one you know how i feel about heat because it was an impromptu decision i did not have my heat protectant with me and at some point there was smoke coming out of my head smoke i was freaking out as you can see my my hair is very kinky wow i love that i had in general it still looks very kinky though it is you know stretched out and stuff anyway let's go get my bad bitch brave on Last I talked to you guys, I was going to get my hair done, go to queen, and I did, and it looks super cute, you know, like, the girl did what the girl was supposed to do, I'm very, very happy, but then, as y'all probably saw in the clips, I actually got my nails done as well, I saw this other salon right by my house, the one that I washed my hair at, so I passed by and then there was a lady who does nails, and I was like, you know what, it's affordable, even though I'm not quite happy with them, I don't think you guys can actually see, but like, they're not that pretty. But the point of the fact is I won't have to deal with my nails or have to, you know, put on anything during the course of this month, which is like a relief for me. No more chip nails, no more what, 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 what. At least I hope so. Right now I'm at my cousin's house. It's D-Day. It's D-Day. It's Vlogmas intro day. I know I'm not dressed like I'm about to film, but like I've been cleaning up the kitchen or rather the area I'm going to be using to film. But I'm currently waiting for my lights because I forgot my lights at my house. So I sent a cab to go get them and then that's when i'll you know get the lighting set up sorted na, 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 na. the concept is gonna be beautiful it's gonna be beautiful that's all i'm gonna say i'm not gonna tell you guys a concept and what it is until like after you guys see the video and then that's when i'm gonna explain why i did what i did and what and why it's so cute and i'm so excited because i've been planning it for a minute now so right now i should probably be trying to you know beat my face a little bit not really beat my face but do my regular shmegular makeup like you know just wash my face and then i brown yana i'm using my cousin's kitchen because obviously it's it's more spacious it's bigger and i don't even have a kitchen right now i mean i don't have one <laughs> get excited or i'm hoping that i'll be done at least by lunch because it's the 29th today and tomorrow i'll just be you know what 
not even tomorrow tonight i'll be editing it i didn't tell you guys about the music but like the music of this video is was made by my cousin i literally dj stuka makes such really good music you guys should go and like watch it and stuff so i contacted him and i told him that i wanted a christmas jingle type song but like he should make it his and he should make it african or make it r&b god i don't want no copyright nonsense but i still wanted the spirit the spirit of a christmas song so he made this dope he made me two songs and then i chose one that i liked and it's so dope and i can't wait for you guys to hear it it's, it's so very exciting get excited hurry <sighs> So my cousin is like a little bit of a tea coffee collector. She doesn't drink these though, but like I think she just enjoys having like you know Colin and I say options and stuff. I just saw this instant vanilla matcha latte. I've always wanted to try matcha. I always see all these YouTube girlies, all these TikTok girlies drinking matcha. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to try this. I'm going to try this, and then I'll give you guys a review. I'll try it with you guys. The noise is the kettle; it's boiling. Let me get a cup. I swear, I think you can literally tell that we are related by just small things. Look at this. You'd probably find this at my house because I'm obsessed with clear cups. Is there a scissor? Okay, there's no scissors. <laughs> <laughs> God. what i'm gonna say is it tastes good okay okay so much for aesthetic it's a good thing i'm alone in the house because if they were here they'd be laughing their hearts out because i spilled like the whole goddamn thing of matcha i'm not gonna be able to fill this cup let's go i already know it tastes good because like when I tried to open it, it went all in my mouth. So I'm pretty sure this is gonna be good. Mm. Hmm. It tastes weird. I always kind of assumed it would be like coffee, but it's not at all. I can't put my finger on what it tastes like, but it tastes like something I've had before. Something, it's not bad, but it's not like amazing or anything. It's just mild. Maybe it's because I spilled half of it, <laughs> and that's why I don't think it's like all that. But like, it tastes like pillage. It's weird, it's nice. I like the color, but like, it's not sweet or anything. I think I'm gonna add some sugar, and then right now I'm gonna go wash off this mask and then do my face a little bit. Like I said, I was gonna. What is it? What is it? Okay. Anyway, I think last time I talked to you guys was, or last clips you guys saw was, I guess, me preparing for the actual intro. And initially, I was gonna just put the intro in there without even like you know discussing with you guys. But I feel like I underestimated a lot of things, and I feel like we need to have a conversation about the things that I underestimated because my goodness i had forgotten how difficult it was to actually make sugar cookies and make them look good i'm not a professional baker i'm not a professional like decorator i'm literally so bad at it i don't know why i just assumed i'd just be you know so good at it and it was gonna look amazing so you know understand that this is from a beginner you know it was like my third time ever making sugar cookies and like in over a year since I last made them. So still, I'm happy with the shots that I got. Um, a lot of things kept going wrong. The lighting was off a little bit, but like I did what I could with what I could. 
A win is a win. A win is a win. I don't care what y'all say. A win is a win. And it took me all day to film. Literally all day because sugar cookies need to dry and they take a long freaking time to dry. There was just a lot going on. I. There's a lot going on. So the video didn't. You know, the enemy was trying to prosper, but it didn't prosper because I ended up completing my video and shooting what I shot. And at the end of the day, we have a Rogmas intro, ladies and gentlemen. We have an intro. And that's the important part, babes. That is the important part. And without further ado, without wasting any time, this is my Vlogmas intro.